these videos are good because I know a thousand and thousand of tricks, but now and then I say, how the hell did I do that trick? I forget. These videos here are good not only for you, but for me. Because when I forget, I can come back and say, ah, that's how you do this trick, okay? So give it a thumbs up and it's good. Never mind. Let's get on to the trick. This is Johnny Samoa. My name is Johnny Samoa and if you just discover me today, my friend, thumbs up to you because you, my friend, are going to learn some pretty good tricks, man, okay? So thank you for finding me or how did you find me anyway? I would love to hear. But this video here, I'm going to demonstrate how I will actually set up this trick in front of my audience, right? Please cut, mm, cut. Mm. You can cut many times, okay? Cut, 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 cut. Yeah. Yeah, many times, cut, 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 cut. Okay, are you happy? All right. Look, I will show you every card is different. Yes, every card is different. Now, what I want you to do is take a card from anywhere you like. Go ahead. Okay, if you don't like this card, you can change your mind. Have a look, okay? Look at this card, yes? Don't show me them. Mm. Yes? yes? You like it? Okay. This is her card. Okay. Look, your card goes in the middle. Yes? No? Huh? It's in the middle. Alright? I will cut. <laughs> ta da! Ta da! <laughs> no, no, no. Let me shuffle. Okay? Uh, you can see I am shuffling. Okay? Really? Hontoni, I'm shuffling. Okay? Hmm. So now I'm going to find your card. Okay, maybe a black card, red card, no, alright, maybe, oh, maybe this card, maybe that card, mm. 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 no, maybe this card, this card, oh, this card, are you sure it's this card? <laughs> Let me find something here. Okay, your card is in here. Look, 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 look. Okay. Can you please, please cut? One cut. Nice cut. <clears throat> Did you see it? Magic just happened. Look, look. One card is face up. Is your card. Ten of spade. No. Are you sure? What was your card? Uh, nine of clubs. Nine of clubs. Oh my god. This is number 10. Yes. Nine of clubs, number 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine of clubs? <laughs> yes! Yeah! favor you know how good these videos are and these tricks are okay please do like my fan page man all right i'm a real person man all right i love you if you do that and you can comment below i read every comments you can also see my videos i respond to every comments man you know it's nice because i just want to know they are not robots that are watching my videos, man. It's actual people. And it makes me happy to read those comments, okay? Even the bad ones too, alright? <laughs> you know, every fan page is like a review button right over here. Just go there and write some bullshit about me. No, no, I mean some good things about me. Like, give it a five star and say, this guy here is the bomb, is the shit, is the... Whatever, man. You know what I'm saying, alright? Now let's learn something new. Now I have done this trick before, alright? I want you to go and check out this link over here. This is the older version of this trick, okay? You know how a DJ will just play one song and then mix in another song without you knowing the transition in between? This is exactly what I'm trying to show you today. Very simple, okay? When you spread the cards out like this, make some comments that every single card is different, okay? But what you're actually doing is you're remembering whatever card that's at the top. Okay, so number six, okay. You don't, don't worry about the suit, you just remember the number. 
If it's a seven, it's a seven. If it's an eight, an eight. If it's a king, you know it's a 13. If it's a jack, you know it's 11. If it's a queen, you know it's 12, okay? Just remember the number six. You know the number six is over here. I usually spread the cards like this and I tell someone to pick a card, okay? If they take a card from here, I make another comment. If you don't like that card, you can change your mind. So what you wanna do is make it so it looks very fair to the person, all right? But don't forget this card here is number six, all right? Someone takes the card, that card right there. I have no idea what this card is, but I remember the number six. While they are looking at this card, what you are doing is, did you see that? The top card, just put it in like this and square. So when you look at it from the front, it looks, it's all square up. But from where you are, ah, you're cheating over here, bro. See where my fingers are? It's blocking that card, all right, like this. So you make a gap right there. You take their card back from them, all right? It's a 10 of heart. Remember, the whole time you don't know what it is. Look at your card. Now watch what I'm gonna do now. Your card, see, your card goes in the middle. But you're full of shit, it's not in the middle, it's a second from the top, all right? Okay? Now your card goes in the middle. Once it goes in the middle, I tend to look, it's in the middle to show them that you, there's no break or blah, 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 whatever, whatsoever, all right? Now you're going to shuffle the cards. Remember, in their mind, their card is in the middle. All right, you are shuffling the cards like this, they can see this. How the fuck is you gonna find my card? Don't worry. Their card, it's second from the top. This is the six. The idea is take this six and put it down the bottom. How do we do that? This is how I do it. Did you see that? I use my binky to pull this card down. Now this is a hard move to do, but with practice, you'll be able to overcome this, man. Pull it down, but because I've got this hand here, this hand also helps it square up the cards when it goes down. Let's see that again. When you are doing it, talk to them. Like, I'm shuffling the card. Okay, uh, man, where is your card? You mean, what was your card? It could be a black card or a red card or a heart or a diamonds. I've just, I've just did the move, right? Now the card's down here, see? You know, what was your card? It could be a red card. See, if I do it slow, if I move my hand so you can see what I'm... It could be a red card or... See how I square the cards up straight away? Bang! See? You don't want it to come out like that, alright? Uh, what was your card, man? It could be a heart or a diamonds or... Uh, I just did it, right? Now you know this is number six. Their card is now at the top. What you need to do is put six cards down the bottom. And this is how you do it, all right? Remember, last week we did another, you know, silent count move uh, trick. If you didn't watch it, right over here, man, and give it a thumbs up. You know this is their card, so I make some comments about uh, what was your card, it could be that card, or this card, or that card, I don't, but while you are talking, you are counting how many cards that are going down, right? Remember, you need six, uh, or maybe that card, that's four now, right? One, two, three, four, five, or maybe this card, six. You know their card is right at the bottom. When you are counting the cards like, oh, it could be that card, it could be that card, be careful not to show the number six. So, when you are, make sure you have a nice grip on the bottom. Oh, it could be that card. It's nice to pull their card off from the top and then just from the middle or blah, 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 blah. Anyway, like, now this is, their card is right now at the bottom, right? You square these cards up and put those cards on top, right? You can shuffle again if you want. And then what I would usually do now is I give it to them. Can you cut one more time, please? And then they cut. All right, they cut. You need to put this pile on top now. Now, you pretend to make some walla, 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 chani some more, you know. 
I mentioned, did you guys see that? Magic just happened. I spread the cards like this and I say, BAM! That is your card right there. And they say, no, oh, Johnny more you fucked up. And I say, oh man, what was your card? I usually look innocent here and pretend I did it wrong. Uh, it was a 10 of uh, hearts, was it? It was 10 of hearts. What number is this one? It's number 6, okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. <sighs> Maybe that's a 10 of hearts. Bang! Voila! And it was like, oh, Johnny Samoa, you are so good. I am definitely going to like your fan page and give you a massive five star review and also subscribe to you. <laughs> Come on, boys, give this a thumbs up. Now, some point. It is very important that you spread the cards from your left going to your right, okay? Left going to your right. Because if you spread the cards from your right going to your left, the card will not be the same. It will be a diff in different place. So it's very, very important to spread it from your left going to your right, okay? Now this is a harder version of the trick, the coolest card trick, okay? I uploaded uh, a while back. This is the link here if you want to learn the easy version of this trick. But what I like about this trick is I don't need to do any setups because I am actually setting up the trick as I'm doing it, which is really, really good because everything looks so fair to them. Now guys, these tricks here are just things that I come up with, man. I make tricks as I go along, okay? And I am very happy to, to share them with you and I thank you for watching my videos and liking my fan page, man. Every Friday there's something new to learn, okay? If you want to learn some new moves or tricks or blah blah blah, please comment below, man. Let me know. I answer to every comment, man. You know, just to make sure that they are not robots that are writing comments, okay? <laughs> now please. Like this video and give it a big thumbs up and also give me some five star reviews. This is your boy Johnny Samoa saying, do something. <laughs> <laughs>